Now, United States has worried over China giving a $700 million loan to Pakistan as it concerned that, like Sri Lanka, Pakistan too might fall for China's debt trap. Donald Liu, the Assistant Secretary of State for South and Central Asia, spoke ahead of the U.S. Secretary of State, Antony Blinken's three-day visit to India. He expressed concerns that the loans might be used to achieve coercive leverage. In a tweet, the Pakistan Finance Minister, Ishak Dar, confirmed that the amount having been credited in Pakistan's state bank account. China has emerged as a major global power and its loans to countries like Pakistan and Sri Lanka have caused fears, as it may coerce these nations into cornering India in case they fail to pay back. Beijing has already taken Sri Lanka's Hambantota port on a 99-year lease since Colombo failed to service its debts by China. Pakistan, too, is crumbling under enormous economic pressure and China's debt could lead to added troubles in the region. Antony Blinken will be visiting India from 1st to the 3rd of March for a three-day official visit and during the visit he will be meeting External Affairs Minister S. Jai Shankar. This will be to discuss strategic partnerships and also focus on how both countries can work together in the Asian Quad and in the G20. The two top leaders will also discuss defense cooperation and the initiative for critical and emerging technologies. On March 3rd, the Secretary will also participate in a meeting of the foreign ministers of the Quad nations consisting of United States, India, Japan and Australia. With Pakistan and Sri Lanka struggling with their economies, China's growing influence in the South Asia region is being closely watched.